My name is Rodolfo Mendez, and I'm artistic director of Ballet East Dance Company here in Austin, Texas. Ballet East was started in 1978 and incorporated in 82 with two main mission statements. One, to provide a platform for young choreographers and dancers, and the other was to develop a vigorous outreach program in the black and Hispanic communities of East Austin. I'm a native Austinite. I studied in New York for many years on a scholarship from the Martha Graham School. I returned to Austin and joined the Peace Corps. I went to Latin America, to Chile and Costa Rica for three years, where I developed an outreach program for the Minister of Education in both countries. Let's take a look at our artistic vision. The company is a very ballet-based company. I'm a strong ballet teacher more than anything else. And uh, so the dancers are able to do almost any style of dance because if you have a ballet base, you can move with any kind of other style. And then we also have a lot of Horton technique in it, which is very similar to what people know of an Ailey dance company. Our mission statement deals with being a platform for different choreographers on the national level and international level. I brought a lot of talent back with me from New York. Uh, a lot of connections in New York, the Alvin Ailey Company in New York with Joyce Trisler. We're bringing in Regina Larkin, who is the artistic director of Joyce Trisler in New York. And she set a beautiful ballet. Him and Her is based on a national sensibility of patriotism. I always traveled globally and I never really understood what America was. I always just thought we we're all people, humanity. So I started to recognize the community and the people that served through wars or through disasters. We're also bringing Sharon Maraquin, who, who is originally from Mexico City. The piece that I'm premiering here at the Dougherty Art Center is called No Place to Call Home. And it was inspired by what happened to the Katrina survivors and the people that we saw on TV. and then Amberly Huntrell and Melissa Villarreal. They're both uh, Ballet East dancers, and I give them an opportunity to create their own work. I bring in a lot of local choreographers, giving an opportunity for them to create, and this is the way you grow as a choreographer. It's also, also you grow as a dancer, because you're looking at different styles. With Ballet East, I started um, taking classes five, five times a week and the classes were free and I started taking horn technique which was very useful because that helped me to get admitted to the Alvin Ailey American Dance School. I finished my two-year program and now I dance with a professional company called King Dance Theater. For the past two years and a half I come to Austin and I've set five new works to the company Every time I come, I do master classes to teach all the knowledge that I learned in New York, pass it on to the new generation. Some of the pieces are global, some of the pieces are, are social, other ones are personal. The interpretation is also how you feel about the piece and how you feel, how you react to the piece. Our second mission is the outreach program. I believe the arts can transform the lives of the children of the East Side as well as the community. I was in the Peace Corps for three years in Latin America, and I was using theater and dance as a medium toward community development. And I thought I could do it here in my own hometown, and basically has grown to an, a, an incredible amount of students. Our purpose is not just so much dance, but to teach the kids self-confidence. Working with Bali's company, with Mr. Mendez, with Rodolfo, it's been a great experience. Uh, he's a good person, I love him. He's like my second father to me. And I think what he's doing here with dancing is changing people's lives. It changed mine, and I think it changed these kids. When I came to the United States being legal, I felt alien to everything and it gave me that confidence to, to get there and to be myself and not to be afraid to, to go out in the world. And he showed me discipline, confidence, things that I need during to survive when I'm alive and, and to be a good person. This is the uniqueness of this company, especially in the East Side, is that we pay the dancers. We're able also to bring in choreographers from the national and international level to choreograph for the company. With the TCA grant, we're planning to pay the dancers, the choreographers, and invite guest artists to develop and create ballets that are relevant to the community. Thank you.